hello it's back again this time i'm about to head back over to freaking apple why you ask why yes because my laptop started acting stupid again so now i got to deal with my laptop acting a donkey all my designs for basic is on that laptop um everything everything so with that being said i'm gonna head over to apple and see if they can fix it um the issue from what i'm seeing is is if i lift it up it blacks out so it may be a hardware problem and i think it has a lot to do with um it recently falling y'all remember the last freak out if you didn't take a look at this okay so i'm at the apple store because my laptop on the update decided to die not necessarily die but startup software the operator software went missing so if anyone knows me when anything goes wrong with my devices i freak out so i had a little cry session and then um called apple and they tried to do what they could do over the phone but told me ultimately i had to come in so we'll see how long this takes and if they can get this fixed i really don't want to have to buy another computer i may have to right what am i gonna do now mind you i have a brand new iMac in the house I have a brand new iMac but I I barely use it because I'm sitting at a computer all day for work so do I want to sit at another desk to edit and do designs I don't so I need my laptop fixed oh I may have to get a new laptop I don't want to have to get a new laptop I'm about to get a new laptop oh my god we'll see how this goes so let me take you guys there with me and Pray for me. See you guys in a few. So I'm inside the Apple Store, and honestly, the mall is completely empty. The, the Apple Store is packed. Make it make sense. Apple Store don't care about weather. It's so bad that you can't get an appointment, so you might as well just try and get in no matter what the weather is. So I'm gonna try and see what I can do. Old girl here just told me maybe I can just put everything on a turn a hard drive and then upload it to my iMac. Upload it to my iMac. What is this on my shirt? Look. Upload it to my iMac and then drop off my laptop for them to send it out. So praying, hoping, wishing. It's not going to be something too crazy. So we'll see. It's empty. They took it. Going. Hopefully, you can try and fix it in the back and um, I'll have to send it out. That's going to pull me some shit. At this stage of the game, I'm just ready to buy a new laptop, but I cannot. This Dre won't let me. I still haven't even used my iMac. Make it make sense. So before I get to, um, but um, I ain't going to get that one. My braids are all over the place. I need them. Let's pray on it. <laughs> okay, so the last time I spoke to you guys, I was having a whole fit inside the apple store so verdict is in gotta get a new laptop so tomorrow i'm going to go grab me a new laptop get back into my editing get things taken care of i look a whole mess right now i had to drag a hat on because baby when you saw me in the apple store i about pulled my hair out when they told me the price to fix the screen so what I'm going to do at this moment is I'm just going to get a new laptop. Then I'm going to get that laptop screen fixed and then give it to my daughter or my son. Or sell it. Who knows? We'll see what happens. But um, right now I'm about to go to bed. 
get up tomorrow and get this laptop picked up. Hopefully they call me early enough. I can go get it on my lunch break. See you in the morning. Okay, so I did a thing. <laughs> I went and got another laptop, as I told y'all I was going to do. I'm doing this for y'all, okay? So I can get the content up. So let me unpack this baby and get it started so I can go ahead and get some editing going. tried to do the transfer of my laptop to the other yeah I'm not messing with that I'm on my way over to Apple right now see if they can take care of that for me because that's gonna be a one two three and while they get that taken care of I don't have to stress about it and then I can get back to editing these videos that you see today um, obviously if you're seeing this video that means I've gotten everything transferred over and then today we're gonna go and pop by a black expo a black shopping expo a black business expo a black small business expo and see what that's looking like so that we can go ahead and get our basic sweatshirts seven over seven in the next expo what do you think <laughs> he gonna be a mute <laughs> No, I can't. <laughs> but apparently North Carolina got hit with another snowstorm. Bruh, let me show you what we got. We got sun. Got wind. <laughs> but we got dust. We have no snow. This is what they call a snowstorm. What the hell, North Carolina? That <laughs> uh, it ain't not enough. <laughs> So, you know how in vain your boy over here is. We go into the mall up the street. We could have dropped the laptop off and then came back and washed his car. But we at the car wash. That's right, because I, I ain't pulling up nowhere dirty. <laughs> He's special. Do we gotta get out the car? Yes. It's cold. Well, you gotta Look at the, what she got on. I got on a bubble vest. I'm a New Yorker. We don't wear coats. Maybe dope, but I got a bubble on. He got on the snorkel. Oh, oh boy, dude. Look at the snorkel. Look, here we go. What's up, boss man? I want to get the full service. Full service. Would you like anything extra, like tire loss, like tire loss, for fresh fragrance? You got to put the tire loss on, so, on it. Yeah. Uh, full service tire loss? Yeah. Can we get to the mall? You got all day. 1040. You know how Apple store gets. If you don't get there early, you So you, wanna, you want me to come back? No, go ahead and get your car wash. You already here. I said that before he described what he wanted, right? <laughs> just saying. Message. Message. Why does he look familiar? Because you know everybody. No, he looks familiar like from New York familiar. Um, you know everybody in New York. Shut up. Oh, I just said that. Yeah, you just said that. 
Anyway, let's get this car washed and um, see you guys in here. Just had to get it washed, huh? Oh yeah. <laughs> oh my god. <gasps> But goddamn, my rims look like You big man. Right, $25. At least I get my rims clean. Oh my god. Well, I can't use none of this know how because it got so, music playing. You got you cussing. I'm sorry, yo. Oh my god. The man hot. But my thing is like this, yo. Anything, y'all inflating all these prices on anything. Do the stuff right. Do the stuff right. And I get it. It's cold out there. I have a little simply that's why I didn't say nothing. I just took it upon myself and try to clean it. They but, out uh, there doing TikToks instead of doing what they're does. supposed to be doing, getting the car clean right. Forget. So $25 ain't nothing. We're here. But damn it. You got one job to do. <laughs> He need food. He need some milk. <laughs> oh my god. I'm done. All right, so we about to head into the mall, get these laptops. It's an hour into the opening of Apple, and see how there was no snowstorm. I feel bad now. <laughs> now I got f like, I feel bad. I'm sorry. In my mouth, right? Thank you. <laughs> I'm sorry. I feel bad because I what? took it to this car wash and they didn't even do what I wanted oh. them to do. Yeah. Well, they got the salt off for 25 hours. They got the salt off for 25 hours. <laughs> make that make sense. Exactly. You could have rolled through the car wash and I take mine too from time. Anyway, okay. Rubbing salt. Get it? Pun intended. In the wound. <laughs> As he likes to say, sorry, mom, sorry. <laughs> hey, yo. I hope there's nobody in this Apple store. I, f I, f I swear. You for sure there's gonna be some, there's gonna be somebody in here. First of all, this store don't really have nobody be in this store anyway, but they will make you wait an hour or two just to be seen by somebody, just to be spiteful. And that's the part that pisses me off. And Target is right up the street, so mm, I gotta go pick up some slippers from Target. Now that I remember. Well, I, I think I went straight. Mm -mm, you gotta turn. You can't. I don't know. Maybe you can't go yeah, straight. That's the way I went last. Everybody time. else going straight. But that's the way I went last time. So let's head inside this mall. See you in a few. This is what I'm talking about. Do you see how empty this mall is? This mall is empty. Empty. Yes. Empty. 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 <laughs> This is the reason why I don't like coming to the mall. Because I know we're going to do with some mess over there. Let's see how this pans out. What you think? I'm thinking we're going to be. What's your chances? Easy breezy. Andre. Are you serious? So why is there a line outside of Apple? Make it make sense. <laughs> show you a cord. You can do this two ways. You can do it over Wi-Fi, uh -huh. which is going to take all day. Uh -huh. Okay. 
The second way is you can purchase an external hard drive, move it here, and plug the external here and move it that way. Depends on which way you want to go. Yeah. So, Easiest and fastest way. I got stuff to right do. Right external hard drive. Thanks, to man. be honest, to be honest with you. Is that mine doing that? That's your ring. <laughs> Matter of fact, you should have told me what, what you got on this computer. That was FaceTime. That was somebody calling. I don't be seeing this computer. Yeah, that's why. He don't need to see no, nothing. That's why she opened up. That's why the shit Well, Target came through. Inspire the next generation. Listen, I love to see it. They have all of this amazing items in Target for Black History Month, which I feel like it should be all year round. Additionally, these are some of the creators of some of these items. Target gives you the option to scan the code in order to get their full lot. Do you see it? Why you gotta do your nose like that? <laughs> what you got? I'm talking to you, fool. <laughs> uh, chimichanga. Okay, so. You want me to kill a finger? <laughs> she about to make it. He got a mango margarita. It's gone. I got a strawberry mango margarita and he just got a strawberry mango. Ah, strawberry mango margarita coming to him now. So every time I come here, I always get the same thing. I think it's quite funny that no one can see the back of my shirt. I hope they can't see the back of my shirt. They say slutty vegan, yet yeah, I'm eating corne asada. <laughs> I ain't nobody vegan, I just like the shirt. <laughs> he wasn't the bill. He wasn't the real safe, he just wear the costume. <laughs> so. <laughs> it's kicking in. <laughs> no cookie for you. I don't think I'm gonna do that. No, no, no. Let me eat. What up, y'all? I'm heading to the hair salon. I found a Dominican hair salon out here that I'm going to try. Um, we'll see how this turns out. All right, y'all, this right here is a no. Why I had to put a hat on to come home? Make it make sense. This, oh. So I call my hair stylist in Greensboro and I have an appointment for Sunday. Sunday, the day everyone's off. But because she said I cheated on her, she told me this happened because I cheated on her. Okay, Belkis, thank you. I cheated on you because I live in Charlotte now. And, uh, uh, this, throw the whole thing away. 
waste of time. I get in there. Let's talk. Let's talk about it. I get in there and tell me they cannot roll us at my hair because it's after three o'clock. Well, why'd you book my appointment for four thirty? That part, and <laughs> blew my hair out, and then flat ironed it. This is a no. This right here is a no. And then tried to charge me for a deep conditioner when I bought the deep conditioner. Throw the whole thing. VIP wear. VIP wear. What? Why is your salon called VIP? Mm. Let me go get some food and um, cool my nerves. Y'all know how I am. I like to eat. So, I'm about to go eat. Dre's already tearing the food up. You couldn't wait for me? What? <laughs> what you mean for what? I said I was. Oh, mm-hmm. Sound like you're chewing. I'm going to go eat. And I'm going to have him take me to Greensboro and get this fixed on Sunday. This is a whole... This is a... <laughs> There's nothing, I can say nothing good about it. Gotta go. Okay, so Aldi's was a bust and I'm gonna go home. So, I'm gonna feed my kids. I tried, I tried. Yes, you see, I'm wearing a hat after going to pay $40 to get my hair blown out and it looks like straight basura. It is trash, it is trash. And I put a nice, respectfully worded email on their website as well as their Google reviews, their Yelp. I, that's right, I did that. Because it should never, never. I won't relive it because I have to go to Greensboro tomorrow to get my hair properly done on a Sunday. Make it make sense. Somebody get to the house and feed these babies.